How you doing? I'm Bill Telepan. Welcome back to Telepan TV. Today I'm going to show you two of the sandwiches that we go that go into our picnic baskets. Now our picnic baskets are something you can pick up before you go to Shakespeare in the park, or if you just want to take a walk in the park, or if you're driving somewhere, just call us up the day before. We'll have them ready for you. They feature a bunch of salads like the farro tabbouli, a spicy coleslaw. We also make a little blueberry. Uh, uh, pie pockets that you can get with that. But these two sandwiches are very popular. Um, first one we're going to do is the Telepan Cubano. Now everybody has their own version of, of Cuban sandwich. Here at Telepan we kind of Americanize it and, and use some of the stuff that we do here ourselves. So I'm going to take a little serrano bread or like a, a ciabatta style baguette. I'm going to open that baby up. And we got a little mayonnaise and grainy mustard mix here that we're gonna just slather all on there. Like so. And then we take our, our roast pork. Now what we do with our roast pork here is we slow cook it. We marinate it in a lot of herbs like oregano and garlic and, uh, and, um, and some black pepper. Kind of like some Latin uh, spices that I use in the Latin community. And then we take country ham. A lot of people use a little bo boiled ham, but like I like the good s little smokiness from the from the country ham. Good sharp, salty f flavor from the country ham too. Then we take some cheddar. And spice it up a little, we'll take a little jalapeno. And then some of our own bread and butter pickles. So the sweet and sour pickles we like to put on this one. And then we just close that baby up. Press it down and it's ready for, ready to be pressed. Another sandwich that's really popular also is our Hen of the Wood Mushrooms Grilled Onion and Fontina on our own focaccia. And this is popular because it's great for vegetarians. There's no meat, but it has a good meaty flavor. Here, take the focaccia, we cut it in half. I have a little, what we call our house vinaigrette, because this is one that we use here for a variety of things, but also one that I make at home all the time. And it's a mixture of balsamic vinegar, red wine vinegar, garlic, some oregano. I have some cooked Hen of the Woods mushrooms that I cooked ahead of time in a little olive oil. And I got some onions that I either cook, I cooked in a, in a pan, or if you can grill them, great, because you'll get some of that smoky flavor from the pan. So I take the fontina, which I cut up, I put a little on the bottom. And then I'll just take all these mushrooms, toss them really well in there. Press them in nicely. Take the onions, which are a nice, sweet flavor. And it's, like I said, if they're grilled, good and smoky. Top it with a little more fontina. Now I like the fontina because it's a strong flavored cheese and it comes out. It really just melts beautifully together with these two items. We'll just chop, top off a little for good measure. Just press it down. And there's sandwich number two. So we're going to press these now in our panini press. So we always spray the panini press first so it helps from not sticking. We'll rub a little oil onto these babies. Again, it helps if you sort of press them down beforehand. Let them go for a couple minutes so the cheese is melted and everything on the inside heats up really well. There you go, two beautiful picnic sandwiches. A little heat from the jalapeno, the mustard mix together great. This one's really tasty too. I love the way the Fontina works with the onion and the mushroom and the vinaigrette. Hits it. Here you go folks. Two of the sandwiches from the picnic baskets at Telepan starting June 1st. We'll be serving the picnic baskets. Give us a call at Telepan.